What's up, Marvel fans? This is Dan Sims, and in today's video, I'm going to be reacting to the new trailer for The Punisher. So, yeah, they've released a new trailer for The Punisher. So, um, this will be interesting. So, let's see what surprises they might, they'll give us. I mean, not too much spoilers, obviously, but let's see what they give us. So, I'll watch it, obviously, and then react to it, and then break it down of, the, of some new scenes. What could be going on? So, let's have a see, then. Gentlemen, I'm the only authority you will need. Mm. At that point, you shoot. Ooh. Did you kill the target? Oh. Well, what the heck? Things over there are different. What we were doing was wrong. Oh. You did what you were supposed to do, right? Now the only person you're punishing is yourself. Huh. You found Castle? I got something I need to show you. Oh. Michael Chu. The US military turns you into a hitman, Frank. Oh. Looking for Frank Castle, the Punisher. Hmm. I think you know about my case. Castle's the last one. Oh. Oh. Either clean this up or let them take us down. <gasps> oh. Make you my family get to me. Oh. Ooh. Whoa. You have nothing but a war inside you. Hmm. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Damn. You stay on my way. This is not your fight. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. I need to find these bastards that gotta kill them. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. So where does that end, Frank? Oh. <laughs> These men, they decide what the mm. truth is. <laughs> the same thing that happened to you. Oh. Happened to me. We could make that right. Oh. Uh. Oh. Whoa. Oh. 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 Damn! The team must be taken. Oh! Oh! Okay, so, um... That's so shocking, they've just... They just came up with a release date. So, um... If you give me a sec, I'll just, um... Have a look quickly, see what went on. Oh, I'm back. Um, sorry about that. Um, just a bit ago, the um, me light just went dark for some reason when the I was watching the end of the trailer. So, um, but it's all right now. It looks like it's not going to play up now. So uh, let's get to the breakdown anyway. So first off, they start off showing us a background, a flashback of Castle in the um, army, aka the Punisher. And this, this so far, what I can see from his past looks good. Looks pretty good. So we see um, also there. We also find out. Looks like I find out that um, the main villain of the show looks like fa the, the Punisher knows him. So that's really interesting. So it looks like he's in charge of the army. And also there, you can see that Jigsaw's there. Well, who's not Jigsaw yet? And then we see a bunch of gunshots going on with Van Castle's doing. Now we see the bit where he's covered in blood, and then he goes to hit the main villain and says about, "Did you know about this?" So. Something must have happened, and then Fang must have figured out something of about the main our main villain. So he might have found out that all the soldiers he's with are not really good guys. I think that's when he must have found out. Now, really, he punches him in the face. So I'm I'm wondering if that's how the this main villain of the show gets the scar on his um on his left eye. It may not be, but it might be something different, or maybe Fang did cause that. Maybe did give him that. In that um, battle of the eye. But it might have been in a different way. I don't know really. We're the way for the show. Then we get a glit see a scene with the um the this copper who works for the police, but he knows Fangs is alive Fang's alive. So he's like he's working with two sides, like he's with the police and you know, he helps punish her. well, I don't know if he helps him or he just talks to him really. So and Fang talks to him about the um, what they did over there was wrong and uh, you know, all that. And I love what the book says about you had the job you had a job to do and all that. 
And I love when he says about the war still in you, something like that. Then it looks like we get now we get our first um, scene with uh, this must be when the um, first time that Punisher speaks to Mike Mike Troll Mike Troll or Mike Troll Chip or something like oh I'm, I'm sorry if I can't get his name right yeah him so this they must have so it looks like they must have met by phone call I thought it would be a person they first meet well or hear voice really but then anyway so he shows him this video well, what we've seen before of some guy being hanged and being put beaten up really. And then also with it, the Mike Troll says um, that they put a hit a hit with list on the old what something like that, and Frank ain't happy about it. Then we get about the um, the cop woman talking about him, and we can see that the um, looks like you see some soldiers getting ready to find him, and we get a glimpse of the main villain again. Now with this row, you can see that the soldiers come by this um, roundabout, and at the the point you see this what looks like a flashback scene of. Uh, the Punisher with his family. Well, before they de before the family died. Now, I don't know if he's telling. He's trying to say that the soldiers were involved with the murder. Well, that's what it sounded like. But I thought what I'm trying to recall how they said it in Dead. I thought they said that. Well, I thought Fang said that. Um, uh, the fam they were all they were all caught in this crossfire gang thing was going on, and that's how they got killed. But I don't know. I mean, it might be like. Yeah, that did happen. It might have been like the soldiers were dressed up as gangsters, or I don't know. I just had to. Um, I'll just have to wait for the show with it and see how these. Because uh, the show will spray me all for this, so I wanna. Then I'll know what we went on. Then we see the um, Michael Chib. Well, we see bunch of scenes with him, and we see that um, Frank, you know, with his gun, looks like he's going out to kill people again. And it does show you one thing that with Fang's got a person smacks him in the smacks him well smacks his head to this metal door so that looks pretty cool. Then um, what else do we get? Next we see the Michael Chip Michael Chip no Mike Troll I'm sure that's how you say his name and Fang them having a fight. So I didn't expect that because this actually happened in the comics. I heard that these two became friends, but then something happens and then they become enemies. Now I didn't think that that would have gone on in this first in this season. Well, for the first one, but looks like they are. Or unless they do fight a bit and then they make up as friends again. I don't know. I'm not pretty sure how they're doing it for the show. Then next we see Fang getting ready and putting some pet some mud on his face so he's ready to go to war. Then <laughs> we got the picture with Fang. Now he's got a grenade in his hand and just really he takes the pin out and I'm like, you do realize you're gonna get yourself killed, aren't you? <laughs> but obviously he doesn't. Now, and there's also the explosives with it. Now, if you remember in the first trailer, we got um, where this truck hits the black car, and I was wondering who was in there. Well, it turns out it's the police woman who was in there, so that's confirmed that who was in that vehicle. But luckily, Punisher saves her. But with the lines, he says about stay out of my way, so he's what? So I bet he tells her that when she wake gets wakes up or something like that. I don't know. It might have been yeah when he says that to her. Then he goes off. And next we see him all suit up, ready to take on some baddies, I'd say. And then we get Karen, Karen Page is in the trailer again. And she's having an argument with him, saying about is, when's this all going to end? When are you going to stop killing people? Like, well, baddies, really. And in the trailer, you do see a lot of gun action. Like, a lot of soldiers and punishers doing some gun shooting. And it is, lot to, it is hard to explain how it goes on, but there's a lot going in with it. Now with it, um, you see that Karen, you know, as I said, them having an argue. Now with it, you see the um, shot with the Mike Troll, with um, a nest to him. We've got the Punisher van, so yep, yeah, we get to see it for the first time, because they did confirm it was in the show, and you can see a bunch of guns with it. Then you can see that it looks like Fang's digging up a hole, so I'd say he's killed someone, and he's, well, praised them in the hole, or there's, there's something there, he's gonna get for under the ground i don't know it could be it could be one of those and also we, we do get a couple of screenshots with uh, the main villain and that looks pretty cool so we can uh, well they don't give us much info about that guy but it just shows us a what what scene what kind of scenes we're going to see him in then we see more action like more gun shooting and everything then we can see the punisher running away so i'd say that's when he's running away from the police 
Now you see that Michael Chip, uh, Mike Trot, not Michael Chip. I'm, oh, I can't get his name right. He looks like he's being chased by someone because he keeps looking behind him. So looks like someone's adding him. Now with it, you see a shot. Now this is what got me thinking. Now this shot shows you a woman screaming. He's got two kids by her. Now and the next shot, you see it's Mike 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 Trot, a uh, Mike Trot, uh, whatever you call him. Now I don't know if, if he is saying that. Oh, he's got a family of his own now. I've never heard if he has a family in the comics, or or is that a si or does that is that a you know a sister or a relative or friend of his? But if he's got a family, that'd be interesting. So that'd be cool to see what kind of situation he's at with his family. And we see a more Punisher action. Then we see in this bit, we see that Karen Karen's on the floor, and we see the Punisher is on the floor as well. And it looks like to me, it looks like he's about to kiss her, but. I don't think that's happening. I don't think them getting together, but it would be a shock if they did. I mean, I'd be surprised if they got together. Then we see a bit of more Punisher, and it looks like we got some bunch of more baddies. Looks like they're doing their own dirty work. Then you can see one bit that the Punisher is covered in mu uh, blood, and he, you can tell that he's punching someone to death. So, ho, oh, that'll be cool to see. Then you see. Um, well, where the um, first trader soldier were Punisher's taken out these men in some kind of abandoned place. So that looks pretty cool. And then next we see a shot with him in his um, costume again. And you've got the same scene where the Punisher's got the shotgun. But at this time, it doesn't show you the bulk on the floor when he points it at his head. It shows you from Punisher's point of view. With, he's got It's like that. But it's obvious the same scene. Now, last bit, we just got the title, and we also got the release date for the show. So, I'll tell you now. So, the release date for the show is, is November the 17th of this year. So, we're going to wait next month to watch it, so that's not bad. Now, really, uh, when I think about the date now, I said to myself, was, is that too close? Well, isn't that too um, uh, early to release it? No, no, no. Uh, this is what I'm trying to say is. Now, if you well, if you forgot about what happened in Vegas, then I'll remind you. Or if you don't, if you do remember, then you'll know what I'm going to say. Now, in Vegas, not some time ago, we had like it. There was a attack happened, and we had some bloke went out to kill some people in Vegas. Well, in this one area, I believe, or it was something like that. it was like that. But when that happened, I there was some rumors saying about that the show was going to get delayed because if they released did it in the like some time after that, you know, a couple of days after or something like that. It would have looked bad for Marvel, but from here, I don't know, is it, that, is it a good time to release it? Or really, shouldn't they wait a couple of more months, you know, to release it? Because I don't know if, um, if you know, because I'm, I'm wondering about, like, are people going to get angry about that? But I haven't heard nothing yet of them being angry about, oh, why have you released it? We're still thinking about that incident. Well... If that is still being thinged of, but I'm not being bad or anything, I'm just saying that. But maybe it's not bad, but I don't know. I'll just, um, I'll just have to wait on the um, internet. I might try to look up and see if people agree on the date or not. But in a way, okay, we're getting in next month, but is it good to release it? That's what I'm trying to say. And uh, yeah, that's really, guys. So if you do want to see this trailer for yourself, the link will be down in the description below. Uh, leave a comment below on this video. What did you think of it? Did you find it good? Are you going to watch it? Uh, if you've bought, got any new theories from watching this, please comment that with me. I'll love to discuss theories with you. Um, give this a thumbs up. Uh, share this out to your friends so I can get more viewers and subscribers. And if you're new to this channel, this is what I do. I do Marvel and Transformers Cinematic Universe news. I also do trailers, clips, TV spots and spoiler reviews when the, um, the films come out for Marvel or Transformers. Trailers and clips... I get to do those. But if the two are like spoiler ones, then I avoid those. Same for TV spot. Watch them when it's not spoilery, but if they're spoiler ones, I avoid them. And spoilers, as I said, I do them when they come out. And then last but not least, if you want to see my last Marvel video, click here. My channel, click here. Make sure you click the bell so you can be notified when my new videos are up. And here to see my last Transformers video. And, uh, oh, and last but not least, as I said here, if you haven't seen the um, trailer for Black Panther yet, just click here. You will love it. And yeah, that's it really, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this reaction video. Thank you for watching. And see you again soon. Peace.